We've got the birth control pill that um, was for private insurers that passed mm -hmm. here in America. Uh, it's called the Affordable Care Act. So it was nice for me to walk in into my pharmacy and picked up my prescription, did not have to pay anything. When I did not have insurance, I paid for my pills $60, which is extremely expensive for me. Um, and then when I did get insurance, it was 25. But in 2013, it's $0. So this bill really helps women that are private insurers get free birth control pills. Which, uh, you know what, that's a good thing. It's actually good for the insurance companies. You know, it, the birth control pills are cheaper than the issues that come with pregnancies, miscarriages, things like that. Yeah. Um, as for the people who think that birth control is murder, uh, uh, find a rubber room or something. There's, there's no there's no place for you in this world. Well, there's a similar bill in the Philippines that actually Philippines is where I'm from. And they're very, a lot of the political parties there are very conservative, the Congress. Uh, but they actually approved this birth control pill in the Philippines. A, a lot of the women there are not ready to have children. They're wanting to go to school, um, marry later. This is something, this is a step forward, I think, that the Philippines, the member, the Congress in the Philippines um, passed because... Which, which, which is nice because I've heard absolutely a lot Absolutely nice. I've heard a lot of crazy things come from senators in the Philippines. So. The like, whole, like, trying to outlaw masturbation because masturbation's murder. Mass murder. It's genocide. Genocide. Yeah. yeah. You, yeah. You, you One stroke so? at a time. <laughs> 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 okay, moving on. There's the, a bishop in the Philippines said in a statement, cited health risks associated with same forms of birth control, but the bishop's strongest objections regarding this bill have lodged on moral than medical matters, which I think that's dangerous in my opinion, seeing as how this is a realistic issue that's happening. It, did, didn't he say that like birth control would like normalize premarital sex and hurt <laughs> children somehow? In, in, it was like a Catholic bishop was, was talking about hurting children well, there's by Allowing birth control, I've allowing premarital sex. I actually have the quote right here. Oh, good. <laughs> In a pastoral letter, they said the youth are being made to believe that sex before marriage is acceptable. It's, no, no, no. It's not acceptable. If you're out there, it's not acceptable. <laughs> it's fucking awesome is what it is. So, you know. So, provided you know how to avoid pregnancy. Really? Yeah, the priest. Just bang little boys. <laughs> Is this moral? Those who corrupt the minds of children invoke divine wrath on themselves. This F fucking really? This coming from a guy who's a member of a church that hides pedophiles around the world. They have like the pedophile relocation program yeah. as part of the church. It's like a shell game. Yeah. It's like, oh, you touched a little boy. Well, not only that, you have like you have the like, like, Catholic bishops now who are saying that oh no 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 the, the kids seduced the priests. You're an adult. <laughs> like, it's a what? kid. Is you know, I don't. That kind of thinking doesn't even fathom. They need a new hip slogan like, "I'm sorry, we have amnesia," but. Now here, here's a new slogan for the Catholic Church. Catholic <laughs> Church, just just so you know, you can have this slogan. I won't trademark it. You can have it. And, and I suggest you use it. Creative Commons. Yeah. Uh, the Catholic Church. We're not going to fuck little boys anymore. Granted, <laughs> with all due respect to the priests and preachers and bishops that 
are, were not involved in the biggest scandal in history by the Catholic Church. And that's saying something, considering you have like the Crusades, uh, the the Spanish Inquisition, the Roman Inquisition, the medieval Inquisition, and the Portuguese Inquisition. There are like four Inquisitions. There are still credible pastors, yeah. bishops, and priests. Well, that's okay. The Inquisitions ended in like the 1880s, so. <laughs> yeah. Okay. A whole hundred years. Yeah. <laughs> That's some change. Yeah, we haven't tortured Jews for a hundred years. <laughs> so. Well, I, I'm very happy for the Philippines to do something as modern as this because it is a poverty country, a country that comes from poverty, and um, making women not have any kind of form of birth control, not by choice, but by religion, is very, very selfish. Yeah, next week I think they're going to work on the wheel. Yeah. Basically, if you don't like birth control, don't take it. If you don't like premarital sex, don't do it. <laughs> don't tell other people what to do. Okay. <laughs>